when I was doing my research, there weren't a lot of AI tools available. Or at least people didn't know about it. So I had to spend a lot of my time doing literature survey, managing my documents, writing the research paper and then getting it plagiarism checked. But nowadays, there are so many AI tools that are available which you can use to make your life easy and put up the best research possible. Hi everyone, I am Neha Grival. I'm the founder of Wise Up Communications. And in this video, we are going to talk about five amazing AI tools which you can use as a researcher. It's not a sponsored video, so all these tools are my personal recommendations and you can use them free of cost. So without further delay, let's get started. My first recommendation is Research Rabbit. Research Rabbit is an amazing AI tool which fast tracks your entire literature review process. It's almost like a Spotify for research. Just how on Spotify we make a collection of music and then based on our choices, we get recommended similar stuff. Similarly, on Research Rabbit, we can upload our research papers on a particular topic to create a collection of research papers. And then based on that, it will recommend us more relevant research and even more recent research papers. In fact, it also shows you a network of research papers. So through that, you can see which are the most heavily cited papers and probably read that. Or you can go into an author and see which research papers they've published and choose them to read. So in this way, it helps you to do more quicker and more effective literature survey. And the best part, this tool is absolutely free. And the founders don't even have any intention of making it a paid one. So you can max out on this particular AI tool to do a quality literature survey. My next recommendation is chat PDF. Chat PDF basically allows you to chat with the PDF and get your questions answered. It's very similar to chat GPT, where in chat GPT, if you ask it a question, it will search the entire web and then give you an answer. In case of chat PDF, if you ask it a question, it will search the entire PDF that you've uploaded and then try to answer it. This is very useful when you're new to a particular research field. So what happens when you try to read a research paper, you might not be able to understand it completely, either because it has a lot of technical terms which you don't understand, or probably the language used is very complex. In that case, chat PDF can be really useful. You can ask it questions to understand what's written in the research paper. And say, for example, if you don't have a lot of time, it can also summarize the research paper for you in simple words. And the best part, this tool is also completely free. Another great AI tool that I would like to recommend is Trinka. Trinka is slightly more than just being a grammar or spelling correction tool because it has been designed specifically keeping academic writing in mind. So not only does it catch tricky mistakes in terms of technical writing and scientific writing, but it also corrects your sentence structure, tone, language, usage and style, etc. Now, Trinka has other features as well, like plagiarism check, citation check, journal finder, etc. But personally, I did not find it to be too useful. So I would recommend using it thoroughly for your language check. In fact, when I uploaded my already published manuscript, it was able to identify up to 200 small mistakes. So that way I think is quite useful. Now, there are two plans that are available in Trinka. One is the free plan and another one is the paid plan. Under the free plan, you can get your document corrected for up to 5,000 words, which I think is pretty decent. So you might never even have to use a paid version in that case. So whenever you've written a research paper, make sure to get it corrected by Trinka. Another amazing AI tool that I would like to talk about is Consensus. <laughs> to put it simply, imagine marrying Google search with Google Scholar. The product that you will get is actually Consensus. Basically, it is a search engine which uses AI to extract data and then give you findings directly from scientific research. So if you were to ask a question to consensus, it will go through all the peer reviewed journals and then give you an answer. How is this better? Is because when you ask the same question to Google, it will show you a lot of blogs, articles and even sponsored ads, which is written by marketing teams of different organizations. So you cannot be sure that the answer that you're getting is true or not. On the other hand, the answer that you get from consensus is based on scientific evidence. 
as a researcher this can help you get answers to questions you are confused about understand the topic completely or make sure that your research is on the right track the best part yes you guessed it correctly this is also free finally my last recommendation for an ai tool is plage.ai Plage.ai is the first AI driven plagiarism checker which has a repository of billions of articles and does a very thorough check for your report. In fact, it does a real time check which means even if an article was published online 10 minutes ago, your document would be compared against that for plagiarism check. So instead of using some random plagiarism checkers online, might as well run your document through plage.ai for a plagiarism check for free. However, if you're going for a conference or journal publication, in that case I would recommend that you go for a paid version in the same software because then they compare your article through a wider database and even with other scholarly articles. Now the amount for this I also found to be quite nominal because in less than $10 you can get all of this done. Now this is much better as compared to other AI subscriptions where they ask you for a monthly or a yearly subscription while here it's just on a per report basis. So this is again a great tool that you can use as a researcher. So guys that's all I wanted to share with you today. So for your research you can use research rabbit to look for new papers and to manage your literature. If you want to understand a topic completely then you can use consensus to get your doubts cleared. If you are not able to understand a particular research paper or want it summarized quickly then you can use chat pdf for this purpose when you sit down to write your own research paper then you can use trinka to get its spelling and grammar check and finally just before submitting it to a journal you can also get it plagiarism check with the help of plage.ai in this way you can really quicken the research process and publish more papers Now if you wish to learn how to write a research paper from scratch you can join me for my research paper writing course and let me tell you no ai tool can teach you that yet so to know more the link is in the description and in the pinned comment and now thank you so much for watching this video and i wish you have a fantastic career ahead